again. So, um, I'm probably going to make this a monthly thing because I really do like this website. Another Sheen haul, okay? <laughs> Sheen haul. So, I got this in today and I got three items. Maybe I forgot what the fourth item was. I don't, it feels kind of like a shoe some shoes so I think I may have ordered some shoes but we're gonna we're gonna see I think I did but um, uh, I got four items um, none of them are, are all, not all of them are wearable so this is going to be just like Christmas so um, I got this eyeliner aid and um, it's supposed to help with, with lipstick and it's uh, also helps with face cream application and you can apply eyeliner much better, which I usually have problems with. Which, oh, oh, I want to show a trick. I want to show a trick. <laughs> it's madness. <laughs> okay. And yes, I did cut my bangs a little bit shorter than I desired, but I kind of screwed up. Oh, and I can't see well. <laughs> this is going to be fabulous, but... Mm, See, I have myopia. See, right here, and whoop. you see that? You see that? I want. <laughs> I hope people could clap for me. Then I could do like this. And perfect wing, perfect wing. <laughs> I found that out on Instagram Reels. So, so I think I may need to put contacts in to do this. Um, to do this and I don't want to maybe I'll do this mm. here's the thing maybe if I had more subscribers I probably would do that and do a, a demo with this but as long as it doesn't like screw up my eyes I guess I'll you know what I do I'll do a, um, a quick reel or a little short on since YouTube they call them shorts uh, I'll do that and uh huh. well since i have this it's rubbery i was expecting plastic but it's rubbery oh, okay i'll do a short uh, later but i'll probably have to do a real uh, download it and everything but yeah i got me some little earrings i really like the uh clip on earrings because i rarely could see find any Unless it's like something for children or something. Uh, and they childproof this too. <laughs> they probably adult proof this as well. <laughs> Hold on one second. How do I sound now? I totally forget about that. But these are like little stars. Earrings and they have the, ooh. They came off. Ugh. I hope that's not going to be an issue. Ugh. They're, I knew they were like a dollar or two dollars. Good night. But yeah. So you're supposed to slip them on behind the ear. Oh, I see what the. Oh, okay. Okay, now I realize this. You're supposed to bend this back and then this, it's not broken. You actually can slip it on from the back and then you, no, oh, that hurt, that kind of hurt. <laughs> You can pin it, your earrings, like so. Dang, 
and it pinched me. <laughs> I hope I don't get, I hope I don't get a, a disease or something. <laughs> and then you do likewise the other side. And now you got little stars and you look like you got little big studs on the end of your ears so you look cute. So pardon my acne and my chipped nails. I'm, I'm not saying that this is supposed to be a beauty channel but it seems like it's getting there, ain't it? <laughs> so you really can't tell that well. Okay, I'm gonna save the other thing last. I realized what I got. I got some red shoes. I just remembered. They're supposed to be a size six. So, I guess while I'm do, uh, doing that, um, I can't give the uh, I can't give that thing a rating. But these, I'll give a three out of ten, just because uh, it was a pain to get that off and uh, me having to figure out how to put, put these in, but, um, and also some slight pain on my end. <laughs> I think I poked myself real hard. <laughs> so these are some red shoes. I had some red shoes for a while and I missed my pumps. So these are kind of like, I guess they're gonna be some Sailor Mars shoes. Man, they are bright red. They, they're bright, they're much brighter on the camera but um, wow, <laughs> but even in person they're super bright, but they're brighter on camera. Wow, so it's about a shade darker than what's on camera. But good night. Wow, okay. Um, I really don't like how these these are made the way <laughs> the way it looks. <laughs> the, the, no offense to the manufacturer, but yeah, you, you get what you pay for. China, I forget how much I paid. Same thing on this side. Um, the good thing is they keep these intact. Um, but we're gonna I'm gonna try out the shoes themselves. The cushion feels good. And the cushion feels pretty good on, on here, so I think this is gonna be good. Be a good the heel I probably would have preferred for this on them about right here. But I think I'll probably be able to manage. So, I'll give you a final uh, rundown. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna show my show uh, my feet on camera. Just you know, weird weird people out there. <laughs> and I'll give you a, a brief rundown of what I think, and I'll be right back. Okay. Um, as I'm walking in them, um, it's gonna take some while to break them in. Um, I realize uh, plenty toe shoes and me sometimes don't work, <laughs> you know. Um, but uh, I feel like the sole is comfortable, considering how uh, high these this heel is. Um, I wish I had a so considering how high this heel is, um, I. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, let's see. We got oh, we got about four inches. I probably would have preferred three, but um, the narrow. The I should have thought of thought of this, but the probably next time I probably won't get that. But the narrow. If you're not into the narrow foot, that's kind of the the hindrance to it. Because usually I wear a size six. A lot of people were saying that it was true to size. I guess. Uh, in some ways, but I think I probably would have preferred a six and a half. That I, I don't feel so uncomfortable to where I'm gonna fall over or anything like that, or it makes me feel any clumsy. I'm pretty sure if I got w w walked on concrete, that might be a different ballpark. Um, I'm hoping they would last. <laughs> I give these a th like maybe a three to three point five out of ten, uh, just because of just because of the. How they how they are but I'm not sure um, as long as they don't peel off I don't know if they're, they're prone to, to dry rot but um, yeah I think these will be decent enough to re replace my uh, old 
ones. <laughs> Um, but, uh, yeah, so moving on to the final product, I think y'all will probably have get a good laugh out of it. So, what is it? What is it? <laughs> it's one of those, uh, face masks that's supposed to be for your chin. And, uh, so most people, I guess I've noticed on camera, I'm vain. Um, most people will know I'm kind of vain. So, you're supposed to put, you're supposed to help you lift your chin and this contraption should have came with directions. <laughs> I'm just saying, people. Um, I know there are supposed to be ear holes and I think they're supposed to Um, okay, so these are the ear holes. This must be this way since it has this uh, thing right here. And then they have this part right here, I guess, to help lift your chin. So we're putting it right here, putting it right up here. And then we go in the back. And it's supposed to help lift your chin. I guess, I guess this is gonna come, I guess this will, uh, I probably watch too much, too many shows where I see so many people have the nicest looking, sharpest uh, jawline and not, less double chins unless you're watching a certain show with, with some uh, heavy set chick but um it just feels kind of i mean it's not uncomfortable it's just really funny to wear <laughs> it's really fu funny to wear that's all i can say but um Anyhow, I guess I'll be wearing this for 30 days and seeing if there's any results that come out of it. It's not uncomfortable. It feels kind of like, kind of like a spandex, the stretchy material, maybe some, I want to say latex, but it has a little elastic feel to it. But I think it was like two bucks or something, two, three bucks. So it, it's, it's an interesting price to just try. I think this would probably help a little bit with your jawline and, and uh, chin area, which is what I need. But I'm also wondering if it will help with, um, you know, going to sleep at night and not and being able to breathe through your nose instead of your your mouth. I might try that and see. Um, so, anyways, guys, Sheen has bass guitars on the um online now if a lot of people like me enough because a lot of people notice that i do uh, have been playing bass guitar since my uh, like a few months ago since june may or june and uh if anybody wanted me to purchase one online from sheen or music equipment i'm thinking about one music equipment and it was like you know to help with your uh finger stretching and they're like 15 bucks so that's when I would probably be looking at next month in another outfit I was thinking out about using for Halloween but I could probably also use it um, to wear to church or something too um, so that is it um, share the, like and share this video if you're a music guy, person or you you just very curious um, I would like to get 10,000, I think 10,000 subscribers would work because they're the, some of them, uh, the bass guitars kind of look like some BC warlocks in a way. I've heard good and bad about that, but I'm, I'm really iffy about getting a guitar from China because <laughs> I know there's some people that, that get rip off, that are, that rip them off and, uh, yeah. I mean, if I get 10,000 subs or something and y'all want me to purchase from Sheen a uh, bass guitar, because there's one that looks really like, like, 
kick butt. I really would like one. It's a, kind of like a black BC warlock looking uh, outfit. So, um, so yeah. Uh, and I guess uh, like, comment, subscribe, share if you wish. Um, Bob, just if you got any ideas or anything for my next video or for any future videos, just let me know and I'll see you guys later. Stay healthy, stay happy, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye! Woo! Woo! Oh, okay. <laughs>